It's a Thursday night and it's another midweek bonanza. So yeah, tonight we've come back to our founders. You can see the golf huts behind me. Um, we're a bit limited where we can go on these midweekers because we've got to have somewhere that's close to our homes really. We can't be going to Rhine Hill and Limvale and stuff because uh, we, we've got to be off early in the morning. Um, tomorrow I'm, I'm alright, I'm off work tomorrow so I can have a bit of a lay in. Stew's on the usual, got to get to work and that. So as you can see we're on the car park swims. That's where we started off on the first video when we very first come here. Stu's in his favourite swim there. Um, in this one where he had me bream and uh, he had that 19 pound cat out of here. Um, it's dead handy because car's literally there. It's about quarter to seven and um, not, had it, not had anything yet. We have been fishing a little while. Um, I'm fishing both rods at the moment towards the island and Stu on the next swim is fishing one just there on the lily pads. Uh, he's got a solid bag on there for the carp because he's spotted a nice common in there before and the pads have been moving. And then he's took um, the spot from last week where I had all them runs from over there. So he's fishing directly on the lilies over there. So I think he's in the hot spot this week. So he might be the main man of the video this week. Hopefully he'll get a few anyway. So yeah, it's only early, yeah. But this is about the time it kicked off last week. So, oh, I've just seen sort of rippling there. I've seen a few bosh out in them lilies as well opposite. So yeah, we'll um, see how we get on. So Big Stu, I think you're in the hot swim tonight. You're in my swim from last week, aren't you? Same. I've been every week on a blank. <laughs> nah, I think, I think you're going to get a few tonight, definitely. I've had um, multiple liners on each rod, haven't I? So. Yeah, you've had yeah, a few yeah, liners. Either. I've had zip. <laughs> Nothing yet. Well, we'll see, we'll see. It's only early, it's only early, Stu. Yeah, yeah, there's one where, where you are. One's just come out where I am fishing as well on that little yeah, island, yeah. but not not where I'm fishing, but it's not that big, the island. So they're, they're everywhere, aren't they, Stu? I think they're scattered. Yeah. Them pads where my right hand rod is, I've been getting a batter in, haven't they? They've been. Yeah, yeah, there's definitely a couple of fish in there, in there. Yeah. So I've seen a big common in there before. Yeah. Oh. Well, Hopefully. One there again. Yeah, come out to play later. yeah. Right, I'm gonna get a brew. I've not had a brew yet. Right, we'll catch up in a bit. Um, after shaming Stu on one of the other videos at, at um, Serpentine, <laughs> he's um, he's changed his patch now from different colours to one big green one. Um, all golfers are going mad behind us because he's just dug up the fairway to patch are you it. Taking the mick out of my bivy again. <laughs> Uh, better though, isn't it? It is better, Stu. These are battle scars. That's what they are, <laughs> battle scars. That's all it is. Yeah. <laughs> Hang on. I'll, um, I'll drop your rod to... Oh, it could be a good one, this, Stu. Stu's just had a... We were just saying how dead it was, and Stu's rod on the pads has just torn off, and it looks a good one. It looks a very good one actually, doesn't it Stu? Mm -hmm. it's not the front. You can't stop it, it's got to be a cat, hasn't it? No, yeah, it is a cat, I can feel it. Ah right, it is a cat. The way the power on that then, that tore off. Absolutely tore off. Because he was only fishing 10 foot out. <laughs> Go on, Stu. Yeah, yeah. You're on your, you're on your car, aren't you? Yeah, yeah. That was out of the blue, wasn't it? Oh, it's going. This is a good one, this, Jay. <laughs> it's pulling his arm off. 
You're giving that some as well, aren't you? I'm giving it some, yeah, but I don't want to give it too much. I oh, know, yeah, I don't. Unless it goes in the pads, don't. Your favourite swim, this, isn't it? He's in. Oh, it's it's in the pad. Are you out? Are you out? No. I'm the same fun as me last time, a couple of weeks ago. In the pads. Yeah. Probably just where it's dragged you through pads then, isn't it? There. You can see it there. Come on, Stu. Still, on, it could be on that, you know, it's wrapped around that with that plant sticking up in it. Don't know, you remember mine? Last week when we kept pulling and the next minute it was still on once it cut through the lily pads. And just had the rod on the rod rest and it's still on, we think. <laughs> the line went a bit tight, didn't it? So it's a waiting game, Stu. It's exciting, isn't it? Hey, we're back in business. Yeah. <laughs> we're back in business. <laughs> hey, were that put on the rest for a while, didn't yeah. they? How big it is, though? Oh, it's, well, they give you the run around, Stu, so it's got to be half decent. Hey. Come on. It could be a new PB for you this, Stu. I don't want to bomb it because I'm only on a fucking tiny up. I know. You're only on your car books, aren't you? You never know, imagine. It. No, it's a it didn't look that big. No, it didn't, did it? No. no. Oh, God, this side. Is you just playing up to the cameras then, Stu? Yeah. <laughs> it's fucking tiny. Oh, the hell. Mind you, you don't know, you might have them. No. I bet it's the same fish you had last week. But it's fucking so awkward to me, isn't it? Yeah. You have to just let the you just have to let him glide into the net. He's got his tail in. Nice one, Stewie. <laughs> Get in, lad. <laughs> <laughs> Have you looked it? No, I Hopefully I'll have a couple of these, Stu. Stu's top dog today, aren't you, Stu? Yeah, show you how to do it. Yeah. Wee! Look at that. Pussycat. Not bad, that, Stu. Not bad at all. Not ready, have we? No. We'll let you know how big it is in a minute, I reckon to, what size do you reckon? A teen? 18. There we are. Lovely. Got a picture here? No. Get a picture for us. So we on 16 spirit? and a quarter, 16 and a half. So it's 15 and a half. So you were right there, uh, Paul. Yeah, at 15. Okay, so it's 15 and a half. Not bad, Stu. We thought it was bigger to be honest, when it took off. 
And we thought we fought better than I've got 20. 21 and a half last time on it and it fought better than that so yeah. I don't know. At least there's a cat, it's the third cat that like That water is so warm. It's warm, isn't it? Absolutely roasting. Oh my god, I didn't even get that. <laughs> it's just god. You poor Daniels. Flips away into the murky abyss. It's coming up to 12 o'clock now. It's about quarter to 12. Um, she had that cat just before dark. Um, I think it was about 10 ish or something like that. Quarter to 10. I can't remember now. But uh, yeah, apart from that. Nothing else has happened. Um, I've not had a snifters at all. I've not had anything. I've had a couple of little tiny bleeps. That's about it. Uh, Stu's in bed. I've just redone my rods. I did have a live on. And, um, I'm having a bit of a nightmare on this session, to be honest. But uh, I thought I was fishing for roach before. I thought I struggling on struggling for the roach, but I uh, ended up ke getting one. So I set my live bait rod up, cast in, caught the branch, my live had come off, and it was just a complete waste of an hour. So I've redone my other rods again, so I'm back on my, um, my normal rigs, and um, we'll just see what happens. But yeah, I've just got them in now, and it's about 20 to 12 when I last looked, so I'm going to bed in a minute. I can hear Stu's rods, they've been beeping a few times, he's having liners, so he'll be doing his heading because he's trying to get sleep for work. But yeah, he's, I've just heard him out about five minutes ago. I have a couple of couple of liners and that. So where's Rods might go? Um, my mind have just been really, really quiet. Um, not confident at all. And, um, but they can come out of the middle and no workout. Oof, I just heard a cat or a cat come out then in the left-hand corner somewhere. So hopefully... Um, Something will happen during the night. It's it has livened up. The water is pretty lively, but just doesn't. Nothing just seems to be um, taking me bait. But plenty of time, yeah, right. So see what happens. Might see you in the morning. Might see you later on tonight. I don't know. Um, catch you later. Hopefully with a fish. Just this minute going to bed after doing that little intro. And Stu's off to a flyer. Is it a left rod or right rod? Um, right. Right rod again. Same one. Pads. Can't see much at the moment, like. <laughs> Two fish, Stu, if you get this in. On the flyer tonight, lad. You sure it's a cap? Maybe a decent cap if there is one. It's about 12 o'clock now, isn't it? Literally just got in bed and oh, just chilling. Like it's turned into a cat fight now. <laughs> it looks like I can feel when it's slapping its tail. Where's your net? in it? I think it's a cat this isn't it? Yeah, the way it's nodding then. I'm just going over your other line. Where's that going? Yeah. You sure? Is that, is that going or is that? Have you got your line? Let's see what to do, where's he gone? It's a little cat.
Okay, I'll buy one. <laughs> Oh dear beast, you. Well, I mean, uh, we, we was going to show you the, the catfish. It wasn't yeah. massive, but it's just escaped through a hole in his neck. I'm so somewhere. glad it wasn't. It's just got through that hole. That's mad, though, isn't it? Yep, that's mad. Well, we was going to show you the cat. It was a few pounds, wasn't it? It wasn't a big one. It weren't even as big as the last one, that was it? No, nah, no way, What do you reckon? I didn't even see it proper. It was a single, wasn't it? It weren't as big as the last one. I reckon it was about. Fifty pound. Yeah, fifty, sixty pound. <laughs> I can't believe that's just happened. I looked at it and I thought, "Where's it going? How's it doing that? <laughs> How's that even possible?" <laughs> You'll have to fix that net now. Yeah, definitely. Oh well. Not again. <laughs> Stop doing that on videos, you. You smelly ass git. <laughs> oh man, I can't believe it. Right, back to bed, Stu. Quarter two in the morning, and my rods just melted off a bit. And uh, we have catfish number one in the net. Looks half decent, to be honest. Um, not seen it properly, but yeah, I'm gonna have a quick look now. Didn't wake Stu up by accident. I um, hang on, sugar. One sec. By accident, I couldn't find the bloody walkie-talkie to wake him up. So I'm just going to get out now and have a look. <sighs> Probably about two o'clock now. Stu's just being in a few liners. I could just hear his rods beeping again. So he may be in. up in a minute with a fish. Only a smallish one. Where's the start? Ooh. There we are. Ooh, there we go. A nice start anyway, it's better than a blanket. Stu's had two, I've had the one now. Oh, yeah. I'm not gonna be very long, I'm gonna get back in bed. Gotta do my rod, yeah, so on my rod. So just get me to show you this and then get me rod sorted. There we are. A lovely little kitten. Zoomed, right. Let this get let's let this go and um, get back in bed. Here's Graham into his catfish. Number two for Graham, this. Scrapping well, aren't it? Yeah, they're not, they're not. Quite out, this one. Is it on? Oh, your life is gone on it. Oh, 
Good mark this one, I think it's a Me. <laughs> hey. Well done, great. Number two, lad. Fish number four. Doesn't look a bad one, this. Here he is, the cat master. Cat man do. What did that fall prey to? Sorry, bag. There he goes, farty ass. Hi, him. Farty Higgs. Look at that, look at that, did videos? I don't know what time it is, I bet it's only bloody half two, it's not. Quarter to three it is. Quarter to three, yeah. So, there he is. 15 minutes after my last one. Is it? After I got my rod in 15 minutes. Quarter to three. Cut it up as soon as we There she is, look at that. Do you reckon that one is? Longy. Um, what do you reckon? Oh, I don't know, not going to weigh this. It's too late. It's not a PB for you, is it, boys? No. It's the biggest one of the night. Do you reckon? Yeah. Do you reckon it's bigger than that 15 you had? Uh, yeah, I'd say so. Yeah, probably just. Just. Right, let this. There we go. Oi. Nice. Sorted. Oh, it's going to go. Lovely. Slag. Sponge. Slid. Well done, mate. Cool, man. This is ludicrous. My left rod's gone again for the third time now. It's half past three. Literally just jumped into bed. Put my head torch on charge because it's going flat. Lay down, a few beeps, just ignored it, thinking it was a little line or the rod settling or something. And then two minutes later, it's gone again. And we have another catfish. Uh, Got short size. That one hooked here, probably 13 or something like that. I can't have uh, Yeah, something like that. So, yeah, I'm just going to hook this one and let it go. I think it's getting late. Uh, I need to I'll have to do my rod again. So, yeah, sort this rod out, get back in bed, and um, hopefully get an hour's kip or something. I'm just doing that, I've got no landing net and my rod's just started beeping. As I was just doing that little bit of a video then, showing the fish, I've still got one in the net though, that's the only problem if this rod goes, I'm a bit goosed. It was just, the bobbin was just bound, oh. Oh no. It just leaves me clutch a bit because I fished quite locked up. Let's see if that goes. Could be a bream or something. I don't. I know it sounds daft, but I don't really want it to go because I've, I've not got me other landing that set up. Mm. 
No, that's not gonna go, is it? Oh. What it is? Not a cat, put it that way. I think there's a bream on it. Right, well, let me just sort this cat out. Oh. I was just about thinking about bringing this one in because I've not had a tap on it. I think there's a bream on that or something. Um, yeah, we will sort this cat out and then sort this fish out. It must be on there. Looks like a bream bite. Right, take me clutch up. Catch up in a minute. There's that one. Just dead. Sm oh, smallish one. Let's go back. Uh, maybe a scraper double. I don't know. Maybe not. But, uh, about eight to nine pound, I think. Uh, Lovely creature, lovely creature. Right, I'm gonna get this back and see what's on the other rod. Still, the bobbin's still tight, but I think it's just a little bream. It's probably come off now. Right, let's go and get this back and deal with the other one. Yep, I was right. A big old bream. That's two decent sized breams. Of, bre breams? That's two decent sized bream I've had out of here. Uh, yeah, it's a few pounds though. Right, unhook this, let it go, two rods to sort out and it's probably quarter to four now. Be going light soon, right. See you later. It's just gone four o'clock in the morning now. Um, oh, bloody hell, I've just done me two rods from that bream and that cat. Um, well, just had a little thought, I might not go back to bed now, I've only, I think I've only had half an hour 45 minutes sleep so I might stay awake make a brew and just start packing up and then I've not got work today so I might just go home and jump in bed have a quick shower and jump in bed and get a few hours uh, might be better off doing that than trying to get in my busy now and try and have a snooze because I don't think it's gonna happen well I've just done my rods anyway uh, I'm gonna have 10 minutes and have a decide what to do Stu's fast asleep there, he's he's gone but he's got work tomorrow so I didn't wake him up on them last two fish, I didn't see the point so yeah I don't know what to do, I'll go back in bed I might try and get back to sleep for 10 minutes, 15 minutes if it don't work I might just get up and pack up and jump in bed right anyway let's see what happens, see if we get another run I've moved my right hand rod to where I've been getting all my runs from so they're both fishing in the same spot now to the left of the island so um, see if it makes a difference so it was just a little fluky run of runs I didn't even think I was going to catch it today never mind have three on the bounce like that so right let's see what happens let me get my head down ah after landing that last cat I am um, tried to get back in bed, so I lay in bed, um, two minutes, literally two minutes, he had two beeps, I thought, sod this, uh, I'm going to go home and go to bed, so decided to put a brew on, got out my bivvy, started packing my bivvy down, and my left hand rod's gone, and it's just wiped out my right hand rod, so now I've got no rods in and another little catfish. And uh, it's about quarter to five. I've given up. Give up having sleep. So I don't ever do this. Well, don't ever redo this rod now and then go or just really it and go. I've, um, I have took a few bits and bobs down. And this is where I got up to. My swim is carnage at the moment. <laughs> Look at state. Everything scattered everywhere. And then um, my left rod just. Actually, it was my right rod, but it took my left rod, so I thought it was my left rod at first. But yeah, rods, rods everywhere. <laughs> it's just a bloody mess, this swim. So I don't know whether it's leaving it at that now. That's, I can't remember how many cats it is. Four cats? Can't think. Four cats, but all from about half one or out, so I've just had no sleep whatsoever. 
So yeah, I may as well just start loading the car up now and then decide what to do. Uh, I did actually, oh, did actually make a brew there. Put on the bench why I just did that little video because got no rods in. Nothing's gonna happen. So I'm gonna make happy brew anyway and uh, we'll knock this fish. Let's turn the net down there and then Stu will probably be awake soon. By the time I've done all that, Stu will be awake. So there we are, there we have it. The one I've just landed. It's all on five o'clock now. As you can see, light now. Uh, so I sort all my rubbish out. Yeah. Happy days. It's about ten cats in two sessions now. Can't remember if I've had four or five tonight. Or well, last night. Whatever today. Oh, I don't know what I'm talking about. I'm a bit knackered. Right, anyway, it's getting back. It's been out for a minute. Um, not sure whether to do my rods again or not. Probably will, but we'll see. And then Stu will be up in half an hour, I think. You still crashed, huh? Right, sort, sort this out and decide what to do. So yeah, I think that's going to be it for this session. I don't can't see any more getting caught now. Um, I'm going to leave it about another 15 minutes, I think. Then I'll be home for half past six-ish. There's so much sploshing in them lily pads where Stu's fishing on the far bank. Um, yeah, I don't want to get home too early and wait the missus up too early, so I'm going to leave it for another quarter of an hour, half an hour, so it'll be about six o'clock, quarter to six, and then I'm going to shoot and get home and get in bed because I've not been to sleep yet. I don't even think about ten minutes. Well, Stu has woken before I've left. <laughs> I literally just said I'm not, I'm going in 15 minutes, but you just woke up, haven't you? It's packed up at midnight, honey. Oh, I can't believe it. Can't believe I've not been in bed. <sighs> at least I've not got work, Stuza. At least oh, I don't. I, don't. <laughs> I had kind of forgot about it. Oh well. That's the only gutting thing about this. You've got to go to work. But Plenty of liners last night, didn't you, Stu? Yeah. I heard them when I was up. All night liners, mate, but not normal, just beep, like proper, like half a run like that. <laughs> <laughs> oh well, I'll tell you what I've said before on the camera. I know one thing. I'm never coming here again for a midweek bonanza. <laughs> listen, Ever. Listen, Cards. I was thinking exactly the same last night. I was thinking we need to go somewhere a bit harder. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Can't come here and get five runs through the night. Then go work. Too work. Too much, yeah. Too tiring. So I don't know where you want to go next, you. I wouldn't mind fancy. I wouldn't. I'm getting worried about that. You're tired now. Now we know how you felt last week, the week before when you went, I'm that tired, I feel sick. I feel sick and dizzy now. I wouldn't mind trying that spring. Yeah. Only one way you don't catch anything. <laughs> you just get a good sleep. Yeah. Go Lynn Vale or something. But just a bit far, then. Just a bit too far. Oh well. Right. I'm going, I'm getting off ski, okay? No, no, no. See you ladies. Yeah, man. That's twice now I've been up all night, so I won't be doing it again. At least I've not got work today anyway. So I'm getting bed. So yeah, thanks for watching and see you next time, whatever that is.